Today we're out here training on ice rescue. During part of the rescue process, we do reach, throw, row, and go. So part of that reaching process, we can utilize tools that would not typically be used We have the pike pole here. These come in various lengths, six foot, eight foot, 10 foot, 12 foot. And then another tool that does somewhat the same purpose, the Z hook. Both of these on the fire side are used for pulling ceiling, pulling walls on rooftop applications. If we're doing vertical ventilation, pulling back roof as we make the opening with saw. But in this application, we can utilize it. One, as we're transitioning out to the victim on the ice, we can use it to help sound the ice in front of us, checking how solid the ice is, seeing if we need to change from a one knee slide method to going to the full on belly method to, to spread our weight out across that ice. Um, and it also could be used when we get up close to the victim that we can reach out and try to hand the, the end to the victim to see if they can grab on if they still have the dexterity. We can utilize that to help pull them back in as a rescue based scenario. A couple things, again, since they're not necessarily made specifically for ice rescue, you know, we have to be thinking of the pointed end on this uh, so that as we're handing it to the victim to make sure that uh, we're being very careful. So a lot of times we may use the other end to do that. But again, both of these tools, just like in most of the things we do in the fire and rescue world, we utilize something that was made for one thing and find applications to use them in a lot of other arenas.